just a really short reminder about a group camp, group meetup camp uh, thing I'm putting together. So far it's myself and maybe nine others. But if you'd like to come, there'll be a link down below uh, to the initial video and you can check that out. It's going to happen in, oh, not this weekend, but the following weekend, December 4th, 5th, and 6th, up at Crystal Lake Campgrounds, Azusa, all the way at the top, north end of Highway 39. When you are nearing where the gate is closed, at the very top of the mountain. When you look down, you see an incredible view. You'll see a sign that says Crystal Lake, mile, mile and a half. You turn right and go down, you'll see Crystal Lake Cafe. When you see the Crystal Lake Cafe, the campgrounds are just to your left. Crystal Lake Cafe, Ranger Station, continue past them and um, we'll be parked in the campground. Somewhere towards the center, there are 50 campgrounds. Each campground holds easily four to five tents. Um, two cars minimum, somehow can hold three cars. It is a car camping, so bring all your warm stuff. It's getting down in the 40s now at night. Um, even if there's rain, it's going to go. Rain, shine, snow, sleet. It's going to go. Uh, so, let me see. You want to bring, if you're coming Friday, bring food for Friday, Saturday, Sunday after breakfast. We'll hang out for a while, and then everybody will probably split about 11 o'clock noon time. Everybody will get out of there. So, it's going to be Friday night till Sunday noon. There will be a gift exchange Saturday late afternoon, early night. So if you want to get the, get in the gift exchange, buy yourself the gift between ten and twenty dollars. Doesn't have to be anything really extravagant. Wrap it, plain wrap, and uh, we'll write a number on each gift. We'll put them all in the back of my truck, and then on a piece of paper we'll have the matching numbers. We'll put them all in a hat, and everybody grabs a number. If you grab your own gift, you can trade it with somebody. Or if you grab a gift you don't like, if somebody else likes it, you can trade it with somebody. It's all up to you. There'll be a gift exchange. Um, bring, bring your stoves if you have a stove, and we'll we'll do a potluck. Everybody make something. Everybody can share. I'll have three ice chests with ice, um, with food and drinks. Uh, let's see. I'll have. Um, a metal set of horseshoes, we can play horseshoes, we can, uh, if Joey comes, he might bring his movies, I'm not sure, he has a big movie screen sets up, or he might bring his specter detector ghost voice thing, and we did get stuff at the amphitheater, it's supposed to be haunted, we did get stuff, there's a previous video on this, video on that, and if you don't believe the video, and you can show up, show up, you can go with him, you can listen to it yourself, there's no there's real radio signals up there. There's no phone signals up there. There's no radio playing. But you, you're hearing voices. Answering the questions we asked. It was amazing. Um, and another guy had one too. And he was getting the same results. I said car camp. It is hammock friendly. You can use hammocks there. Although only certain campgrounds have trees close enough. This is November, so yeah, you can gather acorns right now, I believe. I believe there's still be some acorns left on the trees if you want to make some acorn bread. It's a lot of work, though. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Bring a stove, bring your fuel, your cooking gear, food, tent, sleeping pad, sleeping bag, lights. I'm going to have, my, my main lantern's broke, but I have a... a USB rechargeable lantern and I have some of those solar lanterns uh, so if you have a lantern bring a lantern you can get water there let me see this I believe there are actually faucets where you can get water but Crystal Lake Cafe is right there I'm gonna bring three ashes so I'll bring my own water um, they're family friendly so, uh, if you're interested, there's a link below to another video, and there are also links to 
how you get there, a little bit about the place, what to expect. And there are multiple hikes you can do from there. We can go up to Little Jimmy, which did not burn, by the way. And you can get water up there. The water's straight out of the tap. It's delicious. Uh, there's a little bit of snow on the ground. Not enough to, for any danger. It might even be gone by now. That was last week I went. It is Most of it is gone, I believe, because um, friend Tammy just sent me pictures. And there's snow closer down to Baden Powell. You can take PCT to Baden Powell if you want. Little Jimmy. South Hawkins is right there. The uh, Crystal Lake is right there. Um, Soldier Creek Waterfalls. We can drive down there and go for that hike. And we will all do it in, in groups. So there will always be somebody at camp. So there's no worry about smash and grab. At Crystal Lake uh, Campgrounds, it's, it's fairly safe. As of right now, I believe in the campgrounds, I believe last weekend fires were permitted. You might want to call up to Crystal Lake and ask, but I believe fires are permitted. But even if they're not, you can bring your wood. If they're not permitted, take it right back down with you. So if you have any spare wood, bring wood. There are fire pits. Bring your stoves. Um, I hope to see you there. Down below in the comments, please let me know if you're coming, what days you're coming, how many are going to be in your group, and we will try to provide for everybody. I'm going to set a few things up. They're pretty cool. So, almost the end of the year. Not much of a year. It's almost the end of the year, so I thought I'd put one more of these on. Hope to see you there. Thanks for watching.